Two. Two bowls. Two. Uh, we have one, two, ball, and three. The ball. Oh, if I take one ball and if I put it on top like this, it looks like there's only two balls, right? Isn't it? Mm -hmm. But in reality, it's an illusion because there's three real balls. <laughs> Handkerchief. Handkerchief. <laughs> there's one ball, two and three, and the fourth one. <laughs> show the coin, and as you turn, you go up, and you show that it's gone, like this. And you can reproduce the coin. For example, you have an empty bag here. It looks uh, empty, and you produce a cellular phone. But if I do it in regular speed, it will look like this. Now just watch. Oh, there's one. You're right. Oh, there's one. Oh. One thing in magic, never believe what you think. Bel better believe what you see, you know. And I will give you an example. If I wrap the ball like this, now, do you see a ball? No. You think there's a ball. <laughs> There's a ball. Don't believe what you think. Believe what you see. No, it's serious. I mean, to give you an example, if you would believe what you think here, you would not believe your eyes. <laughs> see? Yes, the eyes. <laughs> there were three balls. No, serious. You didn't see the third one because it was not a real sponge ball. That's why. Oh. That's the reason. Okay, give me your hand. Now, close it tight and give me some room here. I just want to get one. Look, it's the opposite of the beginning. You remember with the three balls? It was confusing. So if I, if I remove one ball, if I go in my pocket. Now, I don't want you to believe what you see and not what you think. Okay. Do you get confused? No, how many balls do you think you have? One. One? Open up. <laughs> no, okay. Just watch. If I put one ball under, two ball under, and three balls. Now I don't want you to believe what you think, believe what you see. How many balls? No. How many balls? No balls. No balls? <laughs> wow! You'll be surprised, boy. <laughs> Look, she says no balls. <laughs>